manually installing ZFP drivers. In most cases, after first connecting the ZFP panel to the laptop or PC, after the install of the ZFP tools, the drivers needed to allow data to be sent and received will install automatically. However, in some cases, particularly on 64-bit systems, the first time install may fail. In these cases, it is necessary to point out the location of the drivers to the PC so that the installation can proceed. Before beginning the following process, ensure your PC is connected to the ZFP panel via the USB cable. You will need to open your PC's device manager. Please note that this demonstration will be conducted using Windows 7 and this process may vary slightly on other versions of Windows. Open the Start menu and scroll to Computer. Right click and in the drop down menu that appears select Properties. On the screen that appears select Device Manager in the top left corner. When you see this menu select Other Devices and you will see an option for the ZFP device. If the driver has not been installed automatically, this symbol will be displayed next to the ZFP device option. Right click on the ZFP device option and select Update Driver Software. The following screen will be displayed. Select Browse My Computer for Driver Software. From here you will need to select the correct folder location for the drivers. Once the correct folder has been selected, click the OK button to go back to the previous screen. The correct location will now be listed in the search box. Click the Next button to proceed. During the installation, Windows Security may ask for confirmation to install. Ensure the Always Trust box is ticked before continuing. After the installation is successful, this confirmation message will be displayed. For more information about CTEC and its products, please visit www.ctech.co.uk.